everybody and welcome back to the Adventures in Collecting YouTube channel where we take a closer look at the toys we talk about on the show and today, Sectors. So courtesy of our friends at the Nacelle Company and friend of the pod, Brian Volkweiss, uh, we have, have the first two of the revived Sectors here. Um, so a quick refresher on, on the Sectors if you are, if you are unfamiliar, um, very, very popular. Uh, cult classic toy line from the mid-80s, I believe 1985, 1984, somewhere around there, uh, from the mind of Tim Clark, who uh, also friend of the pod and former guest. Uh, he is still involved with the, the project here, and we have them uh, revived. So these are the first two. Um, we are looking at uh, Dargon and Stellara. Uh, of course, two of the iconic characters from that original toy line um, brought to life here on massive blister cards. I love the packaging. Uh, they did such a great job. The, the monochromed uh, accessories here, the nice description on the back, and of course, um, we have our, our, our cutout proof of, proof of purchase. Gotta love it. Um, as retro as retro can get, uh, these, these look incredible. Cannot wait to get them out of the package and start moving them around. So, uh, with that, let's get our sectors into the light box and, uh, and take a closer look at Dargon and, uh, and Stellara. Let's go. Well, folks, there you are. There you have it. There are your first two Sectors figures, and I have to say, I am completely and utterly blown away by how good these are. Um, Brian, uh, David Vonner, everybody over uh, at the Nacelle team should be super, super proud of these. They're gorgeous. They're sturdy. The paint on them, they feel premium. The plastic doesn't feel cheap or anything. The joints all move beautifully. Um, they hold, nothing is wobbly or wiggly. Uh, all of the accessories port in nicely to, you know, hands and holsters. And I mean, it's just, these are wonderful. The paint on Stellara, especially, there is an amazing metallic kind of ombre to her, uh, her, her suit. The best way I could describe it is like, if you've ever seen a piece of metal get, a uh, anandized, you know, or, or, or that kind of heat treatment on it. The purples and blues, they just really pop. The classic kind of gold plastic accessories, um, absolutely love it. Uh, these, these feel real. They feel as real as they are, um, and, and they're just fantastic. And they take me right back to playing with all of, um, you know, Dave's uh, toys, you know, his, his, his 80s toys, uh, you know, when I was younger, you know, in, in the 90s, they feel like that plastic. Um, they feel like, uh, almost like, um, almost like Masters of the Universe figures or, uh, or Thundercats or, um, or, or even like the, the, the Rambo figures, uh, from back in the day, um, which I think were also Coleco, if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, but, um, I might be mistaken. But these, these are fantastic. They did an amazing job. I cannot wait to see um, them add more characters to this as, as the Nacelle-verse and the Sectors team grows. Um, this is a knock out of the park. Uh, an absolute home run and a, and a welcome um, addition to the collection. Uh, even, even just the painting on the, the light dark wash to bring out the details in the costume, um, fantastic. Let's hope we get some, some uh, bug vehicles next, right? Uh, so where can you get these? Uh, you can get these directly from the Nacelle store and we'll put a link to where you can get yours in the description below. And while you're down there, 
let us know what do you want to see next from sectors from from the cell leave a uh, leave a comment below with what you want to see next uh and also while you're down there hit that subscribe button so that way you don't miss it when we uh post new videos while you're liking and subscribing to things please make sure you follow us here at aic underscore podcast on instagram x uh tiktok pinterest uh, where we're constantly posting toy news deals availability anything and everything that we think would help out the community and of course the podcast so adventures in collecting you can find us wherever you find podcasts simply search for adventures in collecting or hit that link in the description below which will take you to our website and you can find links to all of the things that i just mentioned and uh like i mentioned at the top of this review we've had brian on the show we've had uh sectors co-creator tim clark on the show um go back listen to those episodes they're really really good ones and we'll put links to those in the description below as well why not um and as always don't bug out <laughs> until next time.